my name is Kristen. I'm with Tomahawk Salon. Today I'm going to show you how to do a quick and easy fishtail braid. Uh, all I did today was I lightly straightened her hair. I didn't really have to do much. You don't need to make it super smooth or clean. It actually looks better when you have some texture to your hair. All you're going to need is some rubber bands to finish it off, a comb maybe to comb your hair, and maybe a little bit of hairspray. This type of braid, you can either do it two different ways. You can start it by putting a rubber band here and then just having the braid, or if you want it to look more flow into the braid, you don't have to do a rubber band. I'm just gonna do it without. So I'm just gonna take all of her hair and split it in half into two sections, two equal sections. And for a fishtail braid, it's really easy. You just pull the bottom underneath of the first section. So you pull a piece over and then bring it to the other side. So there's no weaving or anything. You just take a piece from the bottom and then put it over the top of the section that you pulled it from and put it to the other side. So again, for this side, I'm gonna take a chunk from the bottom, bring it over and put it in the, uh, into my other hand. And you're just gonna keep doing that. Take a piece from the bottom, wrap it over the section you took the piece from and put it in the other section. So again, you're gonna take a section from the bottom of your section that you're up to next. You're just going to take that section underneath, bring it over top of the section you pulled it from, and put it into your other section. And then on the other side, take a section from the bottom, bring it over, put it into your other section. Just keep going. my fishtail braid pretty early and leave like a pretty good tail because after a while it just starts to get really small and hard to work. So all you need is a rubber band. It's even better if you have one that matches your hair color so that you can't really see it and just wrap it around. And that's it and then you can just finish it off. You can take a little bit of hairspray to kind of hold back any of the little flyaways. But again, this is just a really simple style, really natural, so you don't really need a lot. Sometimes it looks better when pieces are falling out of it, like she has a little bit of like a shorter bang that's starting to fall out. And this is what it looks like when it's done.